Hi friends, welcome to Testing Tutorials Point. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about how to handle text box or input box in robot framework. There are a couple of ways we can able to use that is a visible text, uh, the text box or label or button, which is a one it is visible or not, or enabled status is present or not. And we can able to provide some value or click into that button and clearing the value. This is the way we can able to do it, right? Most over the text box is with our case is basically for verifying the test text box or input box. That is like one value provided for the one particular location, right? And that place whether that particular text box is visible or not or enable or not. And we whether we can able to provide the value to that particular text box or not. And we can able to clear the value for the test call text box these four options we are going to performing some operation into that particular text box okay now in this example i'm going to show you i'm going to use for google chrome and here the text box whether this text box is visible or not are enable or not and i'm going to provide some text to this particular text box and also I'm going to clearing the text into this particular one. Okay. Before that, please go through that my previous video, then only can able to understand more on that. This is a link sections and moreover can able to understand for those things. 02 dot robot. Okay, I'm going to copy paste same code here. Okay. And I'm doing these things. I don't want to do remaining things. Okay. Now, now you can able to see here, we have, I don't want to click button itself. Now we are going to concert in two text boxes visible or not and all right. And basically see here now we are using for name of the export right. Before that because we need to use all the places export. This is a simple export that's why like name field that's why it's very simple. In case a lengthy export then again and again all the places we need to use. We are checking for visible text and enabled and providing the value and clearing four places we need to use the X path. That is not the correct way to use the all the time for the same X path every time, right? For do do that, we can able to use some other format. Okay. First, maximize the browser window. Then use dollar and use this one curly brace and we can able to use name field set variable and you can able to specify this one and you can able to use this particular one first thing is we need to verify element should be visible and we need to specify the location okay and element should be enabled and i need to specify the location this the two things we can able to check whether this particular text box is enabled or not uh, is a, uh, visible or not those things and the second case is like we are providing some text to that particular field place okay now after two seconds we are going to verifying that we need to use for clear element text and specify the location of that and wait for two seconds of sleep the after cleaning for the text 
okay then close the browser this is the operations we are doing we are doing for element should be visible and men should be enabled and we are providing for text box to some value and we are clearing for text that particular text box okay these are the things we are going to do now we am going to use for two and i'm going to use it now it will load the page and after that it will maximize the page then it is enter and it will wait 2 seconds and it is clear wait 2 seconds then it is closing right this is a format we can able to perform some operation to that particular browser related options like text box in the browser how we can able to check for the one particular text box is uh, visible or not or enable or not we can able to provide the some text clearing the text this all the things we can able to do this is the format of using i hope you understand this video and please like my video please subscribe my to channel don't forget to make some comments if you make the comment then only i can able to give more content of that video thank you for watching